A national tree planting event at the Moy Forces Academy in Isili was the latest epicenter of the raging debate on management of Nairobi County government, a protocol hitch pitting Governor Mike Mbuvi Sonko against Environment and Forestry Cabinet Secretary Kiriako Tobiko. It is now my singular uh, pleasure and honor to invite His Excellency the Deputy I think the status program is very clear. That I'm supposed, Your Excellency, the, the, the status program is very clear. After the, the anthem, is the governor of Nairobi speaking, then invites the minister, then the deputy president, then Your Excellency. Imambe kuni undermine tafadalini to wacheni. According to the day's printed program, the event's master of ceremony was to invite Sonko after the prayers to make his address and later invite Tobiko, who then paved the way for Deputy President William Ruto to invite President Uhuru Kenyatta, Sonko reading mischief and blaming top government officials that he claimed were undermining him. Yes, bora tu pawa yetu kidogo kama governor ni wachiwe. Kwa juu kula watu wapo hawa ambini kama ni mekua governor. Na hii ni vita hata wewe mwenyewe 2012 2013 uliipitia. Ukaakiwa makesi zingine za kishenzi. Sonko has had a series of run-ins with Interior Affairs Principal Secretary Dr. Karanja Kibicho, who he accuses of heading a team of detractors out to undercut him, but Kibicho has rubbished Sonko's claims, terming them attempts to look for scapegoats to hide his incompetence. The governor has been on the spotlight with questions being raised on his capacity to head the country's capital city. Littered roads are a normal phenomenon in most estates with heaps of uncollected garbage headlining Sonko's list of challenges. He has however shoved the blame to his predecessor Dr. Ivan Skidero and unnamed cartels for his failure to turn Nairobi into the green city in the sun. <laughs> Mukapena pesa ya mabarabara ya katano, mukapena pesa ya health facilities ya katano. Kwa hivyo watu ile shida ni mezi inherit wasiseme ni shida za Sonko. With his competence questioned, Sonko claims the city was being littered deliberately in a well-crafted sabotage script by key state house and Harambe house operatives. He's also in a dilemma over the choice of his deputy following the surprise resignation of his deputy Polycap Igade in January. Igade quit barely six months after assuming office, citing failure to earn the trust of his boss to enable him deliver services to Nairobians, a bill crafted by the then Muranga Senator Kembe Gitura to expunge Nairobi from the list of devolved units fell to sail through in the Senate last year after Parliament adjourned in June for the August general election. The disbandment debate dominating the social media recently, pitting city lawyer Ahmed Nasir Abdullahi against Sonko and his supporters. Kila mwaka, hii county ya Nairobi inatumia karibu shilingi milioni mia saba ati kupatia contractors wasafishe huu muji. Muji huu umesafika? Muji huu ni safi? Sitakataka imejaa kile pahali? Si ni kweli? Wanasema ati sonko hoja soma. Lakini mawaziri wangu sio wamesoma. Sioni matakrokat. Sioni maelit. Wafanye kazi ama waende wapi? Nairobi County has received the lion's share of devolved funds in the last five financial years and currently has a budget of 35.9 billion shillings. Francis Gashuri, Citizen Weekend.